In the United States criminal justice system, we use a cash bail system in which you must pay a set amount of money in order to be released before your trial. The bail amount is set based on the severity of the crime and your perceived flight risk. Let's take a look at the pros and cons of the cash bail system. Cash bail incentivizes people to show up for their court dates instead of just fleeing the area in hopes of avoiding punishment. Without the risk of losing money, there would be much lower incentive for people to show up to court and more people would be released immediately after being arrested. Cash bail systems are widely used and understood. Moving to a new system could create numerous unforeseen problems, such as a greater number of missed court dates and additional criminal activity by previously arrested people. <coughs> Cash bail places an unfair burden on poorer Americans. Americans living in poverty often can't afford to pay even a relatively small amount of bail, and this can force them to stay in jail for months without being convicted. This can also lead to many other problems such as job loss, even if they are eventually found innocent. Wealthy people can use the cash bail system to escape justice even for severe crimes. A bail amount of hundreds of thousands or even millions can be set for people suspected of high crimes like murder. And while the vast majority of people would be unable to pay these, and thus remain in jail, the mega wealthy can not only afford to pay this but can often afford to lose the money and afford to flee the country as well. This means that the mega wealthy can escape justice. Pre-trial services are more cost effective and efficient. Keeping someone in jail when they don't have the funds to pay bail costs a fairly substantial amount of money, typically more than providing pretrial services which assess the flight risk of a suspect and perform various monitoring of them based on that risk. It makes no sense to spend an enormous amount of money locking up people who are of relatively low flight risk just because they are poor. Let us know what you think about the pros and cons of our cash bail system in the comments below.